Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome to my channel Re on the go. Uh, this is me Strat Ether and you, you know that in my channel I have been sharing my experiences for my Canadian uh, permanent residency application and in today's video actually i will uh, show you and uh, share my letter of intention loi which i submitted during my ontario pnp application so uh, just to start with i will briefly go through my profile again um i'm an ontario pnp nominated candidate and uh, i got the notification of interest from ontario province through my express entry under human capital priority hcp class and after that uh, within 15 days of my eoi submission i received uh, ontario provincial nomination and then after getting uh, express entry ita under pnp nomination class then uh, it took me one month for my PR application submission. So uh, I submitted uh, that application on 20th September 2021. So till date, I have been waiting uh, in the process for getting uh, further update uh, of my uh, PR application uh, whole process. Anyway, so um, please stay tuned with me through this uh, whole video and i hope it will be helpful to you and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you like my video please do not forget to share so let's start with the letter of intention uh, this is the letter actually i drafted by myself so if you like my format you can follow this format so start with the um uh date and then you write the subject letter of intent to settle in ontario or if you are uh which i mean whatever province you are applying you can write over there then you just start with the basic structure and then i Stratita, it's my name daughter of daughter of my i mean here you'll put your father and mother's name along with my spouse son of uh, his father and mother's name over here uh, as because uh, my spouse is my dependent as well so uh, both of us should uh, sign this letter so don't forget to uh, keep your spouse signature in this letter as well and then you write do hereby declare our intent to reside in the province of Ontario if you are granted PR status in Canada following my nomination under the Ontario immigrant nomination program and then you just uh, um, say that how thankful you are i'm grateful to the government of ontario on expressing interest in my application for pnb program oinp hcp so this is actually the human capital priority stream under which uh, stream i received my uh, notification of interest my intention to migrate from uh, bangladesh to uh, uh, ontario um, canada consists of a lot of reasons and some of the important ones i would like to justify in line so after that you start with the reasons so i as i uh, mentioned about my uncle pattern and uncle my, my my father's brother so this is my family tie and i put this point in my first reason so uh, we are very much family oriented people long since my pattern and uncle in the bracket blood relative his name a pr if he is a canadian citizen you write here a citizen canadian citizen who is currently living at uh, the address of his have had a great influence in my life since my childhood we have had a great uh, family bonding with his family since we used to live with his family in the same house when they were residing in bangladesh and this line is absolutely true and as a proof we uh, i mean as we have the similar address uh, we actually stayed in the same uh, apartment building so we have similar address and this is also the proof so in his uh, uh, identity document like the passport my and my address in my passports are actually the same my uncle is pleasurably waiting to support us there and we have already discussed so many things with him regarding job housing and my son's school and uh, in the second point i mentioned that i believe that there are ample of job opportunities of my skill in ontario as my noi for ontario's express entry human capital priority stream was issued under my work experience in business development noc 4163 i mentioned this one because it's kind of tactical i mean tactical reason um as I received the NOI under my experience in that, uh, I mean, that NOC, uh, that's why uh, I wrote that uh, 
since there is a demand in that province uh, that's why my job uh, noc code was in the demand list and i uh, for that reason i received that noi so you can follow this uh, structure and uh, after that uh, third point i wrote that uh, about ontario it's a economic hub of canada and i i'm confident that i will find in rms scope to explore my skill sets for this fast paced city i have already started to discover the job opportunities in ontario especially in toronto through these three uh, job websites and other career sites so i mentioned about job bank and that indeed and linkedin and um, then i wrote that um, it's a cosmopolitan city with plenty of ethnic group vibrant culture that also and motivation for me and also we are impressed to know that the quality of life beautiful national parks and greater employment with earning potential for skilled person is above average so it's just a generic uh, point and then through this leader we'd like to express our immense interest to settle down in toronto if we get nomination from ontario and if our prv is approved by ircc we wrote toronto because my blood relative uncle also live uh, lives in a uh, greater toronto area so of course it's natural that we'll be first will be trying to settle in toronto or near i mean the toronto uh, surrounded area that's why we wrote the actual, actual thing if my uh, uncle lived in other city in ontario i would have actually mentioned about that city which really actually makes sense and then finally we are confidently stating about our settle down to become a residence in of ontario if we get nomination from ynp and prv from ircc so we just bold it out and um then uh just you put uh, your name and your husband's name over here and you just give your uh signature over here so um i'll go through the letter again so from the beginning and uh first point is that if you don't have any uh, blood relatives there just don't mention anything it doesn't matter it doesn't add any point unless it's your brother sister or father and mother the first love first level of blood connection otherwise it doesn't matter i mean it doesn't matter actually anyways um and uh, you can skip this and you just start with uh, the job opportunity and everything but i will prefer that uh, the second point this point you can actually follow this it's a, i think it's a very good uh, uh, interesting uh, point i mentioned it's very uh, tactical in my com in my sense actually okay um yeah that's it i think that that's it i think you can follow and you can add at your uh, ease or at your preference any other points if you want to add so uh, i'll be sharing more uh, more videos regarding the application process like the reference letter format the bank letters format and other documents which i prepared for my whole uh, application for pr and also for this uh, ontario so just keep uh, keep tuned with me and stay with me i hope that i can be helpful my videos can be really helpful to some of you so again don't forget to subscribe like and share my videos and god bless you all thank you so much bye